let's go for a ride! You are watching Cycle Cruises all on one motorcycle channel. Subscribe today! Cycle Cruiser videos brought to you at 6 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Look, it's a Pokemon! The Pokemon! Look, it's a Pokemon! Look, it's a Pokemon. I just want to give you an update and let you guys know I've got a new uh, uh, black box camera or secondary motovlog camera uh, set up now on my helmet. This is on my, uh, my LS2 uh, dual sport helmet that I thought I'd share with you guys. You know, anytime I, I come up with any new ideas or whatever, I always share it with you guys. So... Uh, right now, I've got this. I added a Sony HDR uh, AZ1, which is much smaller uh, action cameras than the uh, HDR AS100V that I normally use. But this one will actually fit on the brim of this LS2 helmet. And all you have to do is just take out that screw and take one of those, uh, the screw that comes off of. Uh, uh, the piece, I forgot the name of it, I don't know, the piece that goes underneath the camera so that you can connect it to a tripod that comes with the Sony action cameras, whatever that's called. But anyways, it has like a screw dial on it. If you break that off and I put the AZ-1 up there uh, and I screw it in, so it's positioned on underneath the brim and also I put... Uh, some pedal tape power grip pedal tape in back of it which actually puts the camera at a slight angle you're getting more of a, a straight view and then I have the can the uh, uh, the USB cable connected to the camera going down the back of the helmet and out to a power bank that I have in my pocket as you guys know I run power banks with my action camera so I can ride you know all many hours out of the day and not have to worry about my batteries going down and also it saves weight because I don't have to keep a battery in that uh, in this uh, backup Sony action camera but it's really awesome because putting it upside down which by the way you can reposition the picture so that it flips uh, on your smartphone uh, you, and I can uh, also I can look up at the brim and I can see that the light is on to make sure that it you know it's still lit up, which is great. And uh, I'll tell you guys, it has worked out really awesome. I like this setup much better than having it on the side of the helmet. And I'll, I'll be honest with you guys that this uh, dual sport helmet I really like for city riding, uh, even on my super sport. Uh, one reason I really love it, especially in the summertime more than anything, it flows more air. And also, I can put my, I have a water bladder in my uh, backpack. And as you guys know, you know, the here is the, uh, the tube here that I can put up underneath my helmet anytime I want to. It's much easier with this helmet to put the water bladder cable, or excuse me, hose up to my mouth much easier than the uh, the street bike helmet uh, because it has a wider space at the chin bar with this dual sport helmet so I've come to really like this helmet for city riding and I highly recommend it if you haven't seen my review video that I've done on it which I did a pretty extensive review I'll include a link to that video in the description and comment section of this video also I'll include a link to where you can get this helmet and the rest of my gear too. I always include my uh, links to my gear, mods, all that in the description and comments section of the video. But if you want to see more of my videos, go to my website, cyclecruiser.com. Click on the menu tab, my videos. All my videos are categorized into various playlists. And one of those playlists is on uh, gear reviews. Uh, you might want to go check that out. And also I have reviews on other products as well. Uh, not just... Uh, but anyways... Uh, hey, subscribe to my All In One Motorcycle channel. Hit thumbs up if you like this video. Share this video with your friends. And uh, let them know, hey, the Dual Sport helmet is, is a fantastic helmet for commuting. And it looks great, too. In my opinion, it looks a lot better than the, uh, the bubble head uh, street helmet. But you don't get a motorcycle helmet for looks. You get it to save your noggin. 
and avoid having a real fucked up day. But anyways, that's all I have for you guys. Uh, so until next time, we'll catch you guys later. Check out my other channel, Psycho Cruiser Motor Vlogs, where I discuss anything and everything, not just motorcycle shit.